Well, obviously he's matured a lot. I mean, he's been through a lot now. I mean, he, you know, uh, both on the court and off the court, he's been through a lot. And uh, I think it's made him uh, more grateful, um, not that he wasn't before, uh, even more selfless, uh, even more we over me. Um, he's just a senior right now that really gets it. He understands it, he, his role well. He plays within his role. I mentioned last time he's not trying to prove that he can, you know, or, or try to do things that uh, we don't need him to do. And uh, he's really locked in right now. You know, he's playing like you'd want a senior to play. Um, but I think a lot of it's probably Shannon. If I just think he's been through so much that it's really, you know, really got him where he's really locked in. I think he's really, really appreciative, and it means a lot for him to have the opportunity to compete and wear that jersey. I think it's a great observation. I just think he plays the right way. He plays to his strengths. You know, he's uh, he's just really in a good place right now mentally. And, uh, you know, he really cares a lot about uh, the team, as do a lot of the seniors and all the guys. I think that's what gives us a chance, you know. But obviously at this point, we've got to have some better habits, you know, uh, defensively, whether it's post-defense, whether it's taking care of the ball. I thought we fouled too much in the first half. We had a couple silly ones like, we got to clean up some of those things. Our habits, you know, have to be have to be better than what they are right now for us to reach our potential. But it all starts with effort and attitude. And right now, the effort and attitude of our guys, led by our six older guys, uh, is really really good. I mean, it gives you a chance to coach, and they listen, and they uh, their collective buy-in is really really high right now. And uh, like I said, it gives us a chance to get better.